I often find myself thinking about the meaning of life and how I fit into its complex puzzle. I think back to the day I was taught the true beauty of life, when I realized how screwed up the modern world is, how I connected to nature with the help of an owl and a deer. Long ago, people realized the benefits of killing and eating other living things. They were grateful for the food and thanked the deceased being for what it offered. It was a beautiful thing, a connection at the spiritual level that linked man to nature. But now some men have lost touch with that connection and choose to kill for fame and respect. I did not see the importance of the wild world. I destroyed it and killed whenever I could for no reason. I was on a bad path until one cold December day. I rolled into the river bottom mid-afternoon and started my quiet walk into the oak trees. Nothing was particularly different that day. The pheasants cackled into the icy wind as they looked for a decent meal. The squirrels and the woodpeckers scavenged the oaks and hickories as I began my ascent to my stand. I dozed off after a few hours and was awoken by a rustle in the tree to my left. As I swiveled my head, I locked eyes with a beautiful creature. It was a great horned owl, the wise being that stalked the forest in the night. As I sat there, stunned, I realized how amazing this was to be so close to a wise spirit. We sat there for what seemed like hours. I could see so much in his big yellow eyes. The owl heard what I didn't. Either that or he sensed something that I couldn't. I think that animals possess something that humans lost long ago. A kind of connection to the earth and beings that dwell on it. Anyways, the owl cocked its head and looked past me. I turned slowly to find a buck walking out of the thistles towards me. He was big and proud. His brown coat was peppered with gray hairs. I knew this was my opportunity to kill a legend. The old king of the woods that had eluded all other hunters. I drew back my bow as I had many times before and locked in on the deer's heart. Just before I was about to let the arrow fly, I heard the owl rustle. I looked at him and he looked at me. There was something in those big eyes. I turned back to see the buck looking at me. He had spotted me but chose not to move. I was in awe at what I was experiencing. I realized what I must do. I let my bow down and as I did, the deer ran away. He went off into the timber and out of sight. I looked for the owl, but he was gone too. I was expecting more of a goodbye, but I suppose that's how nature works. I realized the true importance of nature and life at that moment. That owl taught me something about what it means to kill. He gave me clarity. Too often we move at a fast pace and ignore the simple things in life. Sometimes we need to slow down and embrace the beautiful world we live in. That December day, I was awoken. I was alive. <laughs>